respect. So the double honor is the money and the respect. We give the money and the respect. We aren't going to play favorites in the case of 1 Timothy, and as he goes on to say, if he does sin, rebuke him before everybody. We're not talking about playing favorites, but double honor would be respect and money. Give the money when it's due and give the respect. So as Christians, we're called to pay our taxes, respect our leaders, give them the honor that is due to them. So we want to do the things that are right in terms of giving honor to whom honor is due and respect to whom the respect is due, paying our taxes and our duty, and living as Christians should live for the glory of our Lord. Gracious Father, thank you for the privilege of serving you and representing you in this world. We bless your name. Help us to be the kind of Christians that the world takes note of. We thank you for the privilege in Christ's name. Amen. Honor your government officials, but hold them accountable for their actions. John MacArthur is president of the Masters University and Seminary, today showing you some practical biblical ways to do that on today's Grace to You. He's wrapping up his look at the Christian and government. Well, as John has shown in his study, when we sin against civil authority, we really sin against God, who put that authority in place. And John, that I suppose is the main point that we've got to remember. Whatever government we live under, we know it was put there by God. Yeah, that's absolutely true. Government as an entity, Carl, as we know, is ordained by God. I mean, government is ordained by God because God has to restrain sin in society. He restrains sin in the human soul by the law written in his heart and conscience. He restrains sin in the family by the parents and the discipline, the rod. And he restrains sin in society by government. Government has a big job because the whole human race is corrupt. So are we not surprised that all around us people lie? At every level they lie. They lie when they're teachers in school. They lie when they're politicians in government. Are we surprised that murder goes on all the time? The weapons change, but murder keeps happening. That's fallen humanity. So we expect that. Government is critical and as believers, we need to be good citizens. Obviously, obviously, we obey God above government if government tells us not to do something God has commanded us to do. But in all other circumstances, we submit. That's what we've been teaching you in this wonderful series, The Christian and Government. It comes packaged in six CDs and includes a message we didn't even have time to air. So if you want the CD album, you can order it from Grace to You. You can download all six sermons in MP3 format on the website. We'd love to get it into your hands. It's available now. Now, this study is an ideal gift to place into the hands of anyone you know who's interested in understanding God's purposes for government. Pick up a copy of the study called The Christian and Government. Mention the title as you contact us today. That six-CD album is available at a reasonable price. Shipping is included free. Order it now when you call the toll-free number. It's our customer service line, 1-800-55-GRACE. You may also shop online at gty.org. And you can download all six messages from the study, The Christian and Government, free of charge, in the MP3 or transcript format online at gty.org. When you're at that website, gty.org, let me encourage you to check out articles from John and the staff at the Grace to You blog. You can also read articles from our recent series on heaven. You can get biblical insight from many articles that are available about frequently abused verses of Scripture or be spiritually encouraged by our many biblical character studies. The blog is one of the numerous free Bible study resources available online at gty.org. And now for John MacArthur and the staff, I'm your host, Carl Miller, reminding you to watch Grace to You television Sundays on NRB TV. That's Direct TV, Channel 378. Or you can watch online at gty.org. And then join us here Monday for a special broadcast featuring John's message on the kind of leadership God blesses. It's titled, Who is God's Candidate? It's another half hour of unleashing God's truth, one verse at a time, here on Grace to You. Thank you.